Hello friends, welcome to my Jaltech channel. As I told you about weak gets in my previous video, I told you that in my next videos, I am going to teach you which kind of weak gets available in Flutter and how can you can use that weak gets. As you can see, I mentioned some weak gets over here. We have total 13 weak gets over here. And if you want to know how to use these weak gets with, with various kind of uses, then try to uh, listen my old videos carefully and do subscription for my next videos as you can see uh, available all the gestures we are need right now I added to this list and as I found much more I am going to add this in say this list let's start with the first one is text or now in which we are going to use this center text let's start with first please remove this extra code which mention over here through this we need just on stateless we get because we know we are not going to change that state and you can also remove this material app we are not going to use this material right now as we are starting from basic we are going to use one center tag as might be you know that center tag is useful when you want to align something in center of the available space to use this you just have to use this constructor which is named as a center and inside this we are going to use one text con constructor but you can't add directly just text you have to create one children of this center you can create either children or child that depend on you because child as i want to know you about because this child it can only get only one widget but if you want to assign multiple widgets then you can go with children right now i just want to get you some text over here so i am going to use this text and i am going to provide hello world and let's run this on our emulator as you can see we have one error over here why we are getting this error friends if you are not using material app you must have to provide one more we get this is di directionality we get to use this directionality we get you just have to add one value to this text constructor which is text direction and provide this text direction as you like i like to left to right so that i am going to use the tab left to right and just hot reload this and as you can see that because of this center constructor the hello world which is a text which is printed at the center let's let me just minimize this so that you can see both the thing at a time now you can see we have one text inside the center hello world and text direction friends do not forget to mention this text direction otherwise the same error will also you get from every video uh, as you can see we have one text direction dot ltr let me allow you some how many values can text construct as you can see here i provided first of all the string data as you can see we are provided here a string data and after that you can provide many things inside this text constructor which is if you don't know what is this curly braces in dart programming language then please consider to see my crash course on dart programming language as you can see we also provide inside this text a style which kind of style you want to provide how much text alignment you provide as you know we used this one this one you have text direction as you can see here we used this text direction and after that we have a overflow how to handle this overflow and much more let's use some style over here style and i want to give a text style so i am going to use text style and i want to just increase the font size so i am going to use font size let's let me bigger it and i am going to give it uh, 40 let's increase the size of the context on in here is 50 as you can see because of this font size 40 friends this 40 is a pixel is a, it's a logical pixel value and you also have so many more properties in text style as much as you can no, you can learn about all this style property from online and you can edit over here. You have many kind of font family, font size, font color and also you can change color of it like I can add one style color 
and if you want to add color you have to use one class colors dot and this is going to give you a primary colors let choose it as a blue and roll what roll on it as you can see the color is changed from white to the blue and we also have many more overflow text align you can align text inside this constructor you can change overflow we can change overflow in two direction either you can set a clip or you can use a eclipse this two is provided by the text friends clip means that will be clipped and directed to the downwards and eclipse means that this will be redirected to the three dots here three dots will be mentioned let's just give you one example here some rendered random code let's just enter some random code and as you know that we do not provided any clipping as you roll hot roll out it you can see that the text will be clipped from here and if you mention overflow text as you can see here we have a text overflow eclipse text overflow clip fad visible let's use this text overflow eclipse and just hot reload it you can see three dots will be there at the end of the screen because it's going to be overflowed this is all about the text constructor you can pass this many values to this text constructor but what if as you can see here hello world and this some random code you can see all the bolds and italics are same but what if you want this word in some different values or different font weight and hello in some italic then at that point of view you required one more advanced we get which is known as text dot reach which is same as text but as i told you in dart course that text is the class name and we also can provide an identifier if you don't know how to use this text dot identifier then please mention that you must have to watch my dart crash course to know what is text dot reach and as you can see we have to use here a text span let's just remove this part text span inside this text span we are going to mention the childs let first of all mention one text which is an hello world hello as you can see this is the basic style of text but what if you want to add some more style then at that time you have to use let's we want to print hello beautiful world then we required hello and more two fields to add two fields as you know child can add only one field so that's why i am going to use children over here inside this children i am going to add here a one list method and inside list we insist this list only can text text span so that inside this list you can only add a text span let's add one text span inside this text span you can give values which you want to print let first of all print a text which kind of text you want to print over here i want to print beautiful beauty full and which kind of style you want to give here you can add a style let give me text style and i want as i as i mentioned earlier i want to provide a some different font weight so i'm going to add font size and i want to mention font size as 40 i also want to add one more text span inside this i want to add text hello beautiful world and this world i want to provide a style text style and i want to add font weight font weight as 50 and i also want to provide color colors dot and i want to add a green let's run this code how this looks like on a here will be resolved going to and as i said previously if you are using any taxes you must have to provide one thing here 
which is known as its direction we have to add here one text direction as text direction dot ltr because of that we are getting error of no direction element found let's hot run load again you can see here all text is are of different size this is the default hello after that we added a beautiful in a text span as a font size 40 and after that we added a word with font weight bold and at last we are provided color green friends i also want to share some text rich constructor as you can see a text rich con constructor its first require argument text span must as it require a text string data as you can see we provided a text span over here after that you can mention many things like styles if you want to provide a text dot reach as a, a default style of this child text hello and if you want to align it text direction as we mentioned over here which is must be required if you are not using here a material app and we can give many more as overflows and max string and all those all those stuff thanks friends thank you for watching this video this is all about text we get if you want to know more about this we get then subscribe my channel and do like if you like my video and friends if you are getting any error in this android studio then let me know about your errors and comment section and if you can ask me in my email address which is provided in description thank you friends thank you for watching this video